All right, right now at six, battling bed bugs. The problem seems to be growing across our area. In fact, some local exterminators are calling the problem an epidemic across the state of Ohio. First News reporter Cameron O'Brien talked to local experts about how these pests are spreading and hiding in homes. She's live in the studio with our top story at six. Andy Gramsky says he's seeing a spike in bed bug calls throughout the Mahoning Valley. He says people need to be aware of these pests, not just at home, but everywhere they go. Bed bug, bed, bed bug, bug, bed bug. Oh, yeah. Day after day. After day, after day. Andy Gramsky's calendar has one major theme bed bug exterminations. He's got appointments across the valley just about every day this month. He's booked through May. Anything from office settings to property management companies call me because they deal with high volume um, customers, and then also the hotel motel. Um, nursing homes, daycares. Bed bugs are a big nuisance because they're often hard to spot. Gramsci says most folks don't know they have them till they get bit. So, you know, they feed on you, then they'll hide on the box springs, headboard, footboard, behind picture frames, the woodwork around windows and doors, baseboards, cracks and floors. Gramsci showed me his process for finding these critters. It's all about being thorough. A creature, it literally pull cushions aside. Looking for exoskeletons, I'm looking for eggs, live bugs. Uh, the feces, which is a peppery material. The good news? Bed bugs don't spread disease to humans. Their impact, aside from bite marks and rashes, is largely psychological. That's why Gramsci says, spare no expense in getting them out. When it comes to treatment, you're better off sometimes to get it all done. And that's just a peace of mind in your own home. You can still sleep at night. Gramsci's advice if you're traveling and wary of bed bugs is to be proactive. He says, call the hotel or motel ahead of time and ask them for the details on their latest pest inspections. Also, use the internet. Gramsci says customers will often leave reviews if there are bed bugs at a hotel or business. And the last method of protection is inspecting yourself when you get there. That means bring a flashlight and look for obvious signs of bed bugs like blood spots or exoskeletons. In the studio, Cameron O'Brien, WKBN 27 First News.